Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I'm very happy to uh, introduce our first guest today. Um, Moshi, who's joining us from Agulik, is here to talk to you about being a biologist and what he does in Agulik. Welcome, Moshi. Hi. Cool. Hi, I'm Moshi. Um, nice to meet you I, guys. I took biology at Carleton University, so I'm going to talk a little bit about the biology classes that I took. And then I think I'm going to do a demonstration where I'm going to try and extract DNA. One of the things that we can ask, are you guys related? Yeah. Yeah? What, how, what are you guys to each other? Brothers? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So we can ask, why do these two brothers look alike? Right? And that's one of the things that biologists did, is how come they've got two eyes? How come they've got a nose? How come they've got this? Do you guys have the same nose? Yeah, you guys might have the same nose. I don't know. How, like, how come people always make more people? How come people don't make a walrus? Up north where I am, we have walruses. We have, like, we have these things that live in the water, and they've got, they grow tusks like an elephant, but they grow them like this instead. I put it all together now and yes please <laughs> what's your name? we'd have these Erlenmeyer flasks that were connected to a vacuum and then you'd have the funnel be over the Erlenmeyer flask and so rather than have gravity pull it down we'd have a vacuum pull it out <laughs> like that cool so, all right, all right, we put the alcohol into the strawberry solution so far. And one of the things that you guys might not be able to see, all right, so is that in the, that the, what's inside the test tube is like a red solution, that's the strawberry juice that we had, and then on top of it is a clear solution, and inside that clear solution you might be able to see like a white spider webby dusty kind of okay? All right, try not to hurt you, all right? But, wait, hold on, sorry. Um, so we take the top solution, put it in the epidorp tube, and then start spinning it. And when we spin it, it go like this, like this, like this, like this, like that. And what's collected in here would be pushed down to the bottom of the tube. We'd then take that top part, top, take the solution, and we'd have a little pellet at the bottom of the test tube, which would be the DNA. And that's what, and one of the things I gotta say is that when I, when we were isolating DNA, we'd never get this much, I don't think. If we did, it was a really good day. Do you like your job and why? I do like my job and I think I like it because one of the things I'm going to have to do and I haven't really started doing this yet is I'm going to have to speak with lots of different people and interview them and ask them different questions, get to learn them better. So I think that's why I'm going to like my job. What is your favorite tool? Oh, okay. In Iglulik, there's walruses, right? And about now, people in Iglulik are catching walruses. And what they're going to do is they're going to take a shovel and dig into the gravel. Because in Igl around Iglulik, there's lots of gravel. It's Iglulik's in Limestone Island. And there's lots of gravel. And people are going to dig and take... They're going to make like big sausages, like about this big, out of that, the walruses they catch and bury it in the ground, and it becomes what's called igunak. So what do you have to say about this interview? It's been awesome. It's been a lot of fun. I'm glad you asked these questions. Well, you didn't ask me questions, but I was asked questions. Okay. How do you enjoy videotaping? Good. Yeah. 
Did I give good answers? Oh, yeah. Pretty, yeah. Did I pass? Oh, yeah. You need to cool. 